good afternoon, everyone. I must say thank you for the late tune again and for all his help. And secondly, to my fellow group members, it has been a fantastic journey for me. And I'm also very happy to have met my group on this course, and they have been very helpful for and cooperative. And、um, you know, at first when I saw the group work here, and I was a little bit nervous about that because that's、uh, I don't know how to do that. I don't have the technology background of it, and I don't have the technical background. And I only knew some business small models which I learned from the books and the websites and the lectures. But I don't know how to run them at will. So. At first time, and、uh, I didn't know what to do, and、uh, so here is comes our first and the second、uh, group meeting, and I was like a fly on the wall. Um, but I tried to think about、uh, is that possible? I can't just to went out to say there are some solid startup funding schemes, and、I、wanted to be able to if that、uh, possible to. Improve them with our own understanding, and then release them for a startup purposes. For example, you know there are different takeaway platforms like the Uber Eats, Deliveroo, and Hungry Panda, but they focus on the different customers, and they don't have the different logistic systems, and they have the also they have the different results. And、uh, which one is better? And、uh, you know the, their systems are totally different. So the first idea I came up was that the smart mirror.、Uh, I found that there are a lot of barber shops and hairdressers in the UK, but they actually、uh, every time I saw it, they are full of people. They are waiting for it, but there is just only a one one big TV. On the wall, and、um, I think that most of people, the、uh, you know, the waiting is not good, and so、uh, our time is very、uh, precious. And、uh, I wondered if I could we could reduce the、uh, waiting time and also saving the money for the barber shops people because the、um, a smart mirror they can just、uh, watch on TV on it. Then you you can also look at your hair and so you can talk with your、uh, hairdressers. But here is the thing that we we inter have some several interviews with the、uh, uh, uh, shoppers. They are not very willing to have it because、uh, they think that the it will the cost of it is very high, and、uh, they are not very willing to do that. Is that they think that they have TV is enough, and、uh, now everyone has the、uh, phones, but、we'll, so we give up that project. And then we move on to the museum. All this project that is、um, a tour of the museum itself. It wasn't very clear,、um, even though we have the ex-、uh, equipment to listen to what is going on in、uh, after the the his the story behind the paintings and the famous sites. But we don't know what is exactly、uh, going on. It's not very. It wasn't very clear what is going on. Inside, so we wondered if we could develop an app based on the content to make it easier for the Chinese tourists to understand the history and the customs of a place. Here comes another. Then there here comes another question: Is that of the viability of the idea? Firstly, I must say that the good startup is not just、uh, the you know the good idea and the strong competitors. It's also about the start of members,、um, a good atmosphere in a project team, and、uh, take it forward. One important one important thing I learned was the communication methods. For example, at the beginning, we want to apply the VR and AR technology into our app, but I thought that was firstly the cost was too high, and、uh, secondly. What we should do is to put the content be the first, but not necessarily everyone wanted to willing to rent the equipment. But the rest of our members they think that we should put our core a、uh, competent of the improve the core of the product first before think about the operational part. So there is a discovery event happened. 
Mm, but I, at first, I, well, you know, the both side one are trying to convince each other by all means, including, um, you know, but at, that is the first time I controlled my emotion and my control my attitude. And we have very uh, good atmosphere to fix that problems. And we also asked our teachers to assist us. Finally, it's reached an agreement, and that is the first time how I fixed the problem so fluently. Uh, so uh, I, I, had, I had it's not fluently; it's like uh, so good. Um, but it's basic on our good attitude and our friendly manners. So that is a very good communication method for me because I think that when you treat others will then they will give you a back they are willing to listen to you what you are experienced now and what you are uh, why you have the opposite idea with uh, with them and we can have an agreement in a very uh, quick way yes and uh, that's all that's all my feelings uh, in this course thank you